Welcome to Bump of the Night TV. I'm your host, Orson Hills, and with me always is the man whose favorite planet is Uranus, <laughs> Bourbon Hitchcock. And why are we doing that? Because today's movie is a good one, brother. What's it called? Night of the Comet. Right. Night of the Comet is the movie review this week. Uh, let's do bourbon's uh, already pre-poured bourbon. And I'm going to do a nice single malt with my cigar here. All right, so yeah. you know the routine. We both picked a film to watch this weekend. Not a comment. And we both give you our review. Bourbon, uh, would you okay. like to give us your review of uh, Not right. a Comet? I'm going to let everybody down this week. Uh, oh, really? It was a shock. Because I watched this one. This what? One, what? Oh, I, I, did. I gotta call my bookie. I did watch this one. I did watch this one. Right, right, right. I got a good one. Okay. There was these, uh, this guy that had this, like, cult group, right? They were, they celebrate anomalies. And he, it, it, for like a decade, he kept saying, you know, this is the year the, the, the good almighty power is going to come down and take everybody everyone to heaven with us. We got to get in this spaceship and fly to heaven. And he kept doing it over and over and over. And he had a vlog. He had a, you know, a TV show. He kept saying, damn it all. He got a TV yeah. show and we're stuck on YouTube? Yeah, yeah, that's what it was. It was on YouTube. Yeah. Oh, YouTube. Yeah. Got a TV okay. show. It's a, people, I need a new vessel to get me to heaven. And for your donations of nine ninety nine a month, you can help me get to heaven. And then when I get price there, for heaven. that's what he kept saying. That's and when price. I get there, I'll come back and get you. I'll come back and get you. And then this, uh, uh, he was, uh, they were throwing a big party and it was called Night of the Common. And they, and, you know, and they was, and they had Ace Freely he had him and his band playing there. You what was in his band? Doing the, uh, you know, Seth, I hear you called it. What was the name of Ace Freely's band? Uh, what did it call Freely's Comet? Yeah, you dork. <laughs> yeah. All right, anyway, keep going. So they were playing. They had, you know, Fog Hat and they had Alice Cooper. You know. This movie's bunch is fantastic for that. Yeah. Yeah, the, the bad thing about it was is all the bands were tribute bands. You know, so you know, so you booked the party then. The guy, the guy's name was uh, Payne Healy. That that's what it was, you know. But but he was good. He was good. He did the whole, you know. Said I hear you call it. It was good shit. Man, it made me cry. It anyway, made me cry. They get it. They get in the spaceship, right? They go. So where did the spaceship come from? Was that all from donations? It no, was, it was made out of car parts. Used car parts. They put it together. What kind of car? Flex seal stuff on it. And that thing was, and they knew it was going to make it. They knew it. Because the guy on TV said he would. He, he took a boat, cut it in half, and put screens in it and covered it. And he was floating. Even though his legs was 20 feet apart. But yeah, he, like, he was floating. Anyway, they coated this, this thing, right? Floating. <laughs> so they got they got up about, oh, I know, what, 40, 50 feet off off the ground? Next comet come in there. How'd it go again? And you just will not believe what happened. Guess what? Oh, happened? I don't. I don't believe. Guess what happened? Just guess. One guess. Alf was on the ship. No, it okay. killed it killed all of them. Movie oh. was over. <laughs> it blew bleak. up. Killed every one of them. That's bleak. Yeah. <laughs> he made it somewhere. We're not sure yet. I mean, the word the verdict is still out of whether he made it to heaven or not. But you know. He made somewhere. Oh, he made somewhere, all right. They did find his shoes, so there's hope. What kind of shoes was he wearing? Uh, Versace. <laughs> and then the other one was Gotta a go cheap... space and style, huh? The other one was a cheap Nike, you know, knockoff. <laughs> oh, Kyle, when did you get the flea market? I wouldn't know. Oh, okay. So, in reality, Not the Comet came out in 1984, and, uh... News reports that the comet was going to come really close to Earth, and uh, these people have these parties to watch the comet and going to heaven. You're going to go to heaven. You don't shut up. <laughs> so, 
the radiation basically turns everybody into dust. Uh, I'd say probably kill off 80% of the population. Uh, if you work somewhere shielded, like uh, working indoors, like say in a car garage where it's got metal shielding or something, you uh, were killed. Those that were killed became zombies. So it's a uh, post-apocalyptic survival film with zombie stone in it. Mm. It's schlock. It's great. Do yourself a favor. Go check out Not the Comet. It's one of my favorite films. Uh, and that's why for uh, that BS report. I wonder if that's giving Dr. Fauci a good idea with the pandemic and everything. So you're saying the virus is from a comet. No, nope, that's a good way to fix it. I'm going to fix you. Yeah! What? Holy rat's nest. Look at that thing. That's like an eagle's... <laughs> Golly! Hey, shut up. I'm sensitive about it, okay? It's been a tough season. Dry weather's dried out my beard. I, you know, it's... Uh, I'm sensitive. Shut up. Well, I tell you what. I got the answer for that. Some of my friends at Bear Lawson Beer Company. They ain't selling this cool stuff right? Yeah, just try it, man. Oh, it, it'll take the ratiness right out of that. Shut up. Ugh. Mm, smells good, too. Yeah, what and they've even got some oil. My favorite is called the Study. What's this? What's, look how quick this works. Ah, oh, that is nice. Ooh. So, if you got a beer. Look at that. <laughs> I told you that is... 300% better. Much uh, better. Definitely. So, if you got a beard and you want it to look as good as mine, your best yeah. bet is to use what? Bear Lawson beard oil. It is the best stuff we ever had. I grew a mustache during the winter time just for this stuff. Thanks for watching to the end of Bump of the Night TV. Uh, we've suffered. We know you've suffered. We appreciate it. But we need one more thing from you. Subscribe, share, and like. Please. <laughs> Don't beg. Daddy, why is, why is a Bigfoot reading a book in the backyard?